it's important to make the distinction between uh, imitating Christ and resting in Christ. So we're not called to wear the armor of God uh, because Christ has done that and so we following him must imitate him in that. It's really important that Christ has worn it for us in our place because our imitation of Christ is always imperfect, always flawed, always tainted by sin, even on our very best days. Uh, and what we need in order to stand before God is a perfect righteousness. And that is precisely what Christ has achieved for us by wearing the armor perfectly for us. So when God looks at you and me, he does not see us as failures because we have not uh, put on these pieces of armor. We have been unprepared, we have been weak, we have failed, which of course we have. He sees us in Christ, united to Christ's perfect keeping of all of the law uh, and perfect wearing of all of those pieces of armor so that he is able to look at us in Christ and say, well done, good and faithful servant.